Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. I don't know really what's going on with my hair today, but welcome to my channel. Uh, 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 uh. That was fun. We should do that at every intro. I, again, pulled you guys on the social medias and asked you what video you wanted to see next and you guys wanted a 21 things before 21 video so luckily i actually had a bucket list of things i wanted to accomplish before turning 21 which i will be 21 this friday um and so i'm kind of just gonna read you guys that list and let you know if i did it or not and you guys should you know take this list as like something that maybe you should do before you guys turn 21 or if you are 21 things to think about doing just in general so yeah okay let me pull up the list the first thing on the list is to cut your hair i don't just mean trim it i mean do something dramatically different i used to have real real long hair and when i moved back to ohio i just cut it right off new state new me it's a chance to recreate yourself, so I'd consider doing it. I did that one. Buy a plant and keep it alive. I can't keep plants alive, especially succulents for some reason, um, but I have a bird and I kept him alive for five years. So I think I can keep things alive and if it's like the responsibility aspect, I think I accomplished that. Go to a music festival, duh, I did that. You can see all my music festival vlogs in the bio below. Coachella, uh, Bonnaroo, uh, Wild Palooza, all that good stuff. It was fun, everybody should do it. Save up money and go. Do volunteer work is the next one. And I say this because everybody should be helping in the community, whatever that means for you. And it's just something good to put on your resume, but also something good to do to be involved. I volunteer every Tuesday morning at the Athens County Dog Shelter. Love the pups. I just think everybody should do it because it kind of makes you a well-rounded person, if you know what I'm saying. Next, road trip. I love road tripping. I love traveling in general but i understand that saying go to this place or go to that place isn't feasible for everybody so everybody can find a car and get in it and go somewhere even if it's the next town over just explore a new place then learn to cook at least three meals i did this um ramen scrambled eggs pb and j Try to do more than what I've done, but I'm going to say for me personally, since I hate cooking, I've accomplished this goal. Next, pay it forward. I have done this a few times. Sometimes when I go buy coffee, I tell them to pay for the person behind me, especially if you're like in line at Starbucks or whatever. You can also do this by paying for people's meals. You can do this by helping people out. If you see an old person, help them carry their groceries, cross the road, whatever. It sounds cliche, but do it because it's like a really good feeling. And if you do it one time, you'll probably do it many more times especially during holiday season do that people are less fortunate than you and we have enough wealth to go around even if that doesn't mean money always pay it forward whenever you can definitely do that i'd say i accomplished that and i'm gonna continue to do it rearrange your room whoa the lighting is weird bring me into focus bring me into focus hello okay rearrange your room I did this probably like every month when I was in high school. It kind of just like makes things feel new and exciting and it's just a good way to change up your environment. Change, although scary, is really good for personal growth. So whenever you have the opportunity to change something for the better, do that. Open a credit card, okay? I did this last year. Uh, when I was just newly 20 and I feel like I kind of did it late and now I just now have a credit score at 21 and in a year I have to you know move out by myself to a new state and pay all my bills all by myself and I have like barely a credit score so do it as early as you can and if you're over 21 and haven't done that do it like now today right now start a savings account adulting okay next is do something that scares you for me i have bad anxiety with like being 
by myself I don't know so going to college was kind of that step for me but now moving out of state this summer is gonna be really that step for me so I kind of sort of did it kind of gonna do it remember are we at I don't even know um start something you're passionate about oh my gosh it's never too late so side note this past April I realized that for a while I had wanted to get into like modeling and acting but I thought it was kind of like cliche everybody wants to be famous or whatever I actually realized I had a passion for doing it even if it didn't bring along fame and although it was late for me to change my major because I'm a junior and I'm gonna graduate in like a year I wasn't too late to get started so I did I started taking classes I got signed with an agency and I honestly love it it's something that I'd love to pursue and I suggest that you guys do the same thing whether that's art or whether that's volunteer work or whatever just get involved in something it's not too late don't listen to what people want you to do do what you want to do because i wish i knew that especially going into college pick the major that you want not what's going to make the most money not what your parents want you to do what you want to do that's my rant thanks for coming to my ted talk learn how to wash and dry your clothes i have been washing and drying my own clothes ironing since like I don't know literally as long as I can remember but moving to college has made me realize that most people don't know how to do that um please learn like y'all old you should be doing your own laundry it's good skill make a bucket list it pushes you to do things getting out of the everyday cycle of life because that's real boring set goals for after graduation what is your goal when you graduate like do you want to stay in state go out of state what kind of job do you want start that now you should know that and set that goal for yourself smile more i would like to think that i've done this but i feel like i have a really expressive face i don't know if you could tell but I try to smile as much as possible, especially because smiling is contagious and right now the world needs happiness. Am I right? Can I get a yes, amen, yes? Yeah, so smile whenever you get the chance. Then spend time being single. I'm gonna give this a big thumbs down. I don't think I really did that. I think the longest I've been single in like as long as I can remember is like maybe five months which seems like a lot for some people but it's really not that much for self-growth like everybody i think at some point should do that in their life don't just like love yourself don't need another person to love you we're just gonna skip over that and go on learn to meditate check it helps with anxiety with anger with depression literally everything learn it do it five minutes a day before you go to sleep super easy listen to the ocean over your phone or something do karaoke i have not done this but i plan to do it either over spring break or when i get back because we have a really cool karaoke bar here i think it's fun for everybody and everybody should do it not just because it's a good old time but because it pushes you out of your comfort zone get a tattoo if you're scared of needles and if you don't want a tattoo don't do this but this was a personal thing for myself and now i have two so look who's accomplishing their goals and then the last thing is and this is so important i cannot stress this enough if you haven't done this get on the way get a linkedin and get professional headshots and i say this because no matter your major no matter what you want to do in life linkedin is essential for networking and meeting people that's like boring professional advice but like consider it i feel like i went through that stuff so quick and i'm sorry but i'm trying to keep this video short and i'm kind of a rambler what can i say so i'm gonna sign off now thank you guys for watching this video i hope it wasn't too long or boring um i love making these i love editing these if you have any ideas of what you want to see please let me know i'm pretty much down for whatever and i just want to create content that you guys want to see don't forget i post every thursday so subscribe stay happy stay healthy stay beautiful and accomplish your goals Whew. that was a lot of talking i'm like tired of my own voice my god